from a very young age, I was literally obsessed about Alpine Chamois. When one observes the kind of conditions and habitat that they live at, it's incredible. We are hunting uh, Alpine Shama here in Julian Alps. It's nice weather, the weather is good. It's uh, just minus one below the zero. It's, the wind is really strong, so it makes the whole feeling basically much colder than it is. The day started very well, we zeroed our rifles and obviously with the change of atmospheric pressure, temperatures, uh, we had to be sure that our rifles are correct. Basically we will uh, hunt today um, on the edge of the snow line. We had lots of snow last week. At a glance we immediately observed the first chamois um, just above the peak where, where the snow begins. We started walking our way up, up to 1,900 meters. Two animals, a buck and a smaller buck, about 400 meters from us. And all of a sudden, a slight avalanche just dropped down from the mountain. We are just where the uh, chamois were, and obviously they were spooked off. So we're just going to change our tactic. And we've seen one of these chamois turn back and was walking its way back to the initial place where we've seen it. We started stalking our way up. After carefully observing the chamois, our guide confirmed that the animal is the one to be taken. We had good clear shot and a safe shot obviously. Obviously when we approached the animal, it was a beautiful animal, a beautiful chamois. We're uh, experiencing uh, zero degrees temperature here. Obviously, uh, it was a good relief. However, we finished our hunt successfully and uh, I'm really happy for Lucas. He's a good friend and a uh, great professional in this industry. So he was rewarded in the best possible way.